this video is basically just an honest chat. I just wanted to have a chat with you guys about everything that's been going on um, with me, <laughs> mentally, emotionally, and with my YouTube channel, mostly. Um, <laughs> and I just wanted to inform you guys what's been going on and how I'm going to be going forward with this YouTube channel. And just kind of that whole thing. Where do I start? Okay, so I started my YouTube channel in, I think it's, I think 2018. <laughs> if you go to um, my profile on my YouTube channel, I don't know what year it's going to tell you I started. But um, I, I think I posted one of my first actual, like, one-on-one -on -one videos in 2018. And then, um... I, I'm not gonna lie, I don't know what I actually posted like the rest of 2018 and 2019 um, and then I posted some stuff like some of my short films and stuff um, that was basically it um, and then 2020 um, I wanted to actually start my YouTube channel this was the year when I wanted to be active on it and just because it was it's a hobby that I like it's something that I really liked doing. It made me excited and it was something that I was passionate about. And I had some stuff going on and I really needed something that I could do that was consistent. And so I thought that YouTube could have been that thing for me. But as 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 fate would have it, it wasn't. <laughs> um, this year, a whole bunch of stuff started happening. And honestly, my, my plans that I had for 2020 took a complete like someone's banging doors okay my plans that i had for 2020 took a complete like 360 turn nothing is what i thought it was going to be and i think anyone and everyone can relate to that because Cor because corona because i mean isolation lockdown anything could have been happening that could have stopped you from doing what you wanted to do and if that has happened to you i am sorry i know how you feel it's very frustrating but um yeah some things happen for a reason so 2020 i wanted to start posting on my youtube channel you know um and there were just lots of obstacles that i came across so the first one was um not the first one i'm not gonna go in order <laughs> but basically um so i started to panic about numbers and views and how is this going and do people like my editing style and am i the type of youtuber that people want to watch and bling, bling, and, blong, blong, and all of that stuff and that was the first thing that made me kind of shy away from becoming a consistent um poster um it stopped being a thing of I like doing this and I want to do this as my hobby and so that's why I'm gonna start posting on YouTube um, and I have a passion for it and it started being no one's gonna watch my videos and it sucks and I suck and I'm gonna stop posting now um, so it became a yeah a very anxiety riddled thing YouTube which I never wanted it to be like that but that's just that's just how it started turning out and that sucked so that was one of the first reasons why i just stopped <laughs> another reason was that um basically i didn't know what exactly it is i wanted to do with my youtube channel i wasn't sure if i wanted to be a vlogger or if i wanted to be a diy person or like a tips person or you know i wasn't i didn't know what I was doing and that was very frustrating being and I limited myself on some videos and I tried to push making videos that I wasn't very passionate about just for the sake of oh but this might get um the views and then um mentally I wasn't in a good space okay stuff was a little bit rough okay <laughs> um I wasn't doing really well and I, I kind of lost interest in stuff that I really liked and stuff that I was passionate about. And um, I just, it turned me off because it gave me so much anxiety. I wanted to be good at the things that I loved and I wanted to create things that were like monumental and groundbreaking and, uh, oh, and whatever and all the rest of it. And I had so much fear and doubt and anxiety around it for one. 
that it turned me off of doing the things that I was passionate about and one of those things happened to be making YouTube videos and then there was also just the general mentally I was not doing well I didn't have the capacity to um, make a YouTube channel and keep up with it and keep up with the content and I like making YouTube videos I like recording stuff I like editing stuff I want to be a film student I mean <laughs> I like doing that stuff um, it's not that that I didn't like it was all the rest of it like I just explained and I hope I'm making sense right now um, and so recently I made the decision to fall back from things that I wasn't passionate about um, and that included the things that I was forcing myself to do and to just reevaluate everything <laughs> to sit and kind of recoup and breathe and start again which is okay to do sometimes you need to do that and that's okay um, I've been reconnecting to myself getting to know myself again getting to know God again and reconnecting to God and my spirituality and it's been really good um, there's ups and downs obviously <laughs> there's days where it's not good and then there are days where it's really good and that's normal um, while reconnecting to myself I also rediscovered my love for the things that I had lost interest in before and like very very slowly and very very recently as well um, it didn't like I didn't wake up and suddenly have inspiration to do all the stuff that I had lost interest in it's a slow burn and it still is um, I'm not gonna say like I woke up and like I, I suddenly I wrote a novel no <laughs> There are still some days where I have no interest in doing the things that I am passionate about. And that's okay because everything is, is slow and, you know, takes some time to get going. And that's, I'm learning that and that's okay. So yeah, that, that, that was what was going on with me. That was um, some of the reason why I wasn't posting on YouTube and why I wasn't very consistent. And I hope that I've been able to articulate everything clearly. Moving forward, I want to post things that I'm interested in. Hi, so I'm editing the video right now and it doesn't look like I actually very clearly said what I was going to be doing with my content on my channel moving forward. So basically, I'll be talking about films, TV shows, books, music, dissecting that stuff and recommending some stuff for you guys. And maybe some DIY videos of me upcycling my clothes. I hope that makes things more clear um, because I was honestly rambling. <laughs> I did not record anything clearly or concisely, so that's what I'm going to be doing. Thanks. I'm really excited for where this is going. I'm actually, I'm teeming with excitement. With this excitement and with this passion, I'm hoping to just um, be able to put stuff forward and be consistent and actually post on YouTube. Um, so yeah, very excited for that. Hi again. So I forgot to record an outro. So this is me signing off. Thank you for watching this video and I hope you have a good evening, afternoon, morning, whatever. Um, bye. <laughs>